Hello, so today I'm going to show you how to make a real simple drum beat in Ableton Live 9 Studio. So as soon as you open the app, this is the screen that you'll see. And what you can do is come over here to these three horizontal lines, click them, and that'll take you to this landscape view. So then what you want to do is select four measures, right click, and insert a MIDI clip. And you'll get this bar that appears. And then you can come over to these categories, go to drums, Go to Kit Core 808, which is the one that I prefer to use, and double click it and it will insert it. And then when you go back to this bar, you'll see this kind of view pop up here at the bottom. So then by, by clicking and moving back and forth where there's this little uh, magnifying glass, you can zoom in and out. And there's a lot of different places you can do that. Um, so I like to zoom out so I can see all the instruments. And when you click these, you can hear everything. So then I like to keep it basic using kick and snare. Um, so then you come up to this play button and you can hear what you, what you created. So I'm gonna add in some hi-hats to that too. Maybe some more kick. Um, so then what you can do is if you select everything and click control D it will copy and paste it into the next measure. And if you do that four times, you can get a full four measures of what you made. And then what I also like to do is come in and kind of make some changes. You can kind of make it sound a little nicer. Um, make it so every measure isn't exactly the same and it makes it a little bit more interesting. So let's see what it sounds like. So that doesn't sound too bad. Um, it could sound better, but you know, it's whatever. Uh, so then what you can do is right click this selection and then you can copy and paste it. And you can also do control D for that too. So then it's the same four measure section repeated four times in a row. And then if you double click the start, you can play everything from the beginning and see how it sounds. And uh, that's all there is to it. And then you can add more tracks if you want. Maybe add audio, make some recordings.